Hey, what's up everyone? Uh, today in this video, I just wanted to show you guys how you can add uh, videos or GIFs within the uh, Z game editor. Um, so let's get right into it. I'm on Fruity Loops 20, so it's already obviously opened up. I've got my mixer opened up. So what we're going to do is get our uh, Z game editor visualizer. And like I said in the other video, I showed you guys how to do like the basic with the background picture and just a picture and the little like polar peak effect. But um, if you didn't watch that video, what you're going to want to do is open up a beat, put it in the playlist here. Or you can open up Edison and you can drag the beat into here if you don't have a beat made, if you want to use a song or whatever. So I'll do quickly what I did last time. which is okay sorry my thing's like broken up as you can see but this is the z game editor so i will just add what we had last time and then we will switch it up so i'll go to add pictures desktop and i think i have a folder called pics in here so we'll add that which is going to be a background picture and I'll add this just to show you guys what we originally had set up. So once you got the background image and the image you want in the center, go here. Click on uh, where it says image under image effects. And it's going to give you that like mosaic, mosaic. I can't pronounce it right now. So what we're going to want to do is click here where it says image source and click on this. That's going to be your background image, right? Now, click here on the plus sign. Again, find image. Click on that. And go in image source and click on Simpsons. So this is how I had it in the last video. This is the original way. And um, if you want, just to show you guys the effect. Where's the peak effect? Peak effect? Peak effect? Polar. So that's what I had originally in the other video. And um, where the fudge? So that's what I had, right? And I had another effect, like, which would in the background, like, move around. I'm not going to do that right now. But if you play it, that's what you get. Now, if you want to take it a step further and add a GIF, which I think is super cool, or maybe you want to add a video and make something out of that, you can do that as well. Absolutely. So we're going to go back to add content. And now instead of clicking add pictures, click on add videos. So if I go back to my pics folder, you're going to see actually it's going to have a GIF and a video show up. See these? These weren't visible when I went on add pictures because they're not pictures. It's a GIF and a video. So let me put this Buddha Cartman in. And then you go back to... Uh, your main and we're going to go here where the image is and just replace that because there's no effect for video the only effect that we can do is image but watch so if i put in buddha cartman boom bro he out here living his best life you see that now you can make it bigger all that stuff um there was somewhere i can't find it right now I'll mess up everything but there's a part where you could change how many frames so you can actually make it go faster or slower a little bit um, so that's how you would add a gif if you want to add a video same process just go to add videos so this is the video I had when pigs fly and go back here make sure image is there and select that mp4 so as you can see you can add a video it will play too. The only thing is there won't be sound. I don't know how to do that. I don't know why you would want sound, but I mean, like, I, I can see you wanting to use it. Like, say you have a beat and you want to stop it for a second and play, like, a sound from the click, clip. That would be kind of cool. So if anyone figures that out, let me know. But, um, yeah, that's how you add GIFs. That's how you add uh, movies. I mean, GIFs movies. So uh, I hope it helps you guys out. And if you have any further questions, man, let me know. In the meantime, check out some of the other videos. Make sure to subscribe for more videos like this and uh, have a good day. Peace.